you never this is this sounds like one of those places where you could potentially contract HIV or something like that. What's going on you guys? It's your girl Boots. Um today we're going to go to the worst reviewed nail salon in my city. Let's just start this off by saying that the reason I don't like to get my nails and my feet done, first of all, is because it just wears off so damn fast. Who has time to go get their feet done and have it last for like a week and a half? Not me. Not worth it. Not worth my money. Second of all, I also don't really get them done because ever since I was little, my mom, uh, she would never want to take me to get my nails done and it wasn't until now that I understand why she didn't want to take me. There's so many cases of nail salons that don't properly clean their tools and then they will transfer skin diseases from person A to person B and the only people that are susceptible to that are girls that go to nail salons often. Now, with that being said, I found a nail salon that has some really grimy reviews. I'm just gonna show you guys what the girls that have been to this nail salon are saying because it's worrisome, it's one of the reasons I don't go, and um, yeah, let's get started. Investigator Boots on the scene, here we go. Let's see what's so bad about this place. Worst place ever, very rude staff, unprofessional employees, no customer service at all. Okay, wait, but there's some really, really bad reviews at this place. Hold on, I'm gonna find it. Most unprofessional place I've been to, the lady who did cut my nails cut all of my skin and I said it hurt. She said, oh honey, take it easy, it's not bad. Do mind after all the pain, it was bleeding. So this kind of like shows that they draw blood. <laughs> no, 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 I hate when they cut my, cut my cuticles like all bad because then they get all cut up in the cold and it's just no, like it, it's a no for me. Okay, this is a really bad one. I went to this place yesterday and the lady doing my pedicure totally butchered my toes. I woke up this morning with my toe big, swollen, and red. See, those are signs of infection. That is what I don't want. I'm really hoping it doesn't turn into an infection. It's also very dirty. I would stay away from this place unless you're asking for an infection or fungus. My nail lady clipped so much of my cuticle that I could look at my fingers and see where small pieces of skin are missing from her yanking at my cuticle rather than cutting around it. She then cut open the front of my finger and completely ignored me saying ouch. Not only was she rude, careless, but she didn't even care that she injured me. My pedicure, on the other hand, is sloppy, uneven, has air bubbles, and to top it off, she somehow managed to cut open my big toe Disappeared for five minutes while my toe bled and my friend had to actually ask someone to take care of it What kind of person cuts you leaves you bleeding and tries to not come back? This is gonna be bad. I feel like this is gonna be bad. I Don't think this is a good idea I don't think that people should be testing out nail salons because you can contract so many diseases and infections if these places are drawing blood, which this place is. I'm gonna try and convince Chino to get a mani-pedi with me at this place, which I think is a very far-fetched thing to ask, but maybe if I just don't tell him about all the bad reviews, he'll go with me. But I feel like I have to tell him anyways. Anyways, I'm gonna go head over to his place and hopefully he'll get a mani-pedi with me. I feel like that actually, I already feel like that about going to this place. I'm rolling with boots on this. I'm gonna support her all the way 110%. You know, I believe this is gonna be a good video. I, if, but you know, damn, if you get a skin infection, Linda, I might not. So one of the reviews said that <laughs> this girl got a skin infection that she has to take medication for to get rid of it. And this girl went to this place. And so I don't know how much of a good idea this is. <laughs> this is a good idea. I think this is probably the worst idea that uh, we have came up with. 
and I'm really kind of not looking forward to this. I know. Are you gonna get a mani pedi or just a mani? Hell no, I ain't getting nothing. <laughs> Traps, you you get touched with those weird tools. I never get gonna... my nails or hands done to begin with, so. <sighs> yeah, Boots doesn't really get this. I don't like when they cut my cuticles because it hurts. I don't like it. I don't like it. But anyways, like it. we're about to see how bad this place is. What's the worst that can happen? Okay, so you can get a skin. I get a disease in my skin that starts to break. I don't know. In the reviews, it said that they don't clean the utensils that they use to cut people's skin. So you never. This is. This sounds like one of those places where you could potentially contract HIV or something <laughs> like that because. That's the kind of stuff you get from oh nail salons that don't God. clean their utensils, so. It's like going to a really bad tattoo shop. Yeah, that's exactly what it's like, so. Um, wish us luck. Uh, I hope we walk out of this disease free. I'll uh, bring you guys in when I get there. I'm gonna be wearing this little camera. So right. you guys are literally gonna see everything that they do. Stay tuned. We're here, let me see your heart. <laughs> feel my heart? I can't feel. Let me hear. Let me hear. There's not a lot of meat I can't hear. <laughs> Are you calling me flat chest? No, no, no. I couldn't, I couldn't get it. Couldn't... Okay, I'm really, she's really a little, nervous. She's a little bit nervous. Yeah. Like, I definitely feel like <laughs> nervous. I can anyways. feel it. It's like boom, 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 boom. Hi. I'm here for a mani. Yeah, manicure. No pedicure. No pedicure. You want chair or you want a regular? Um, chair. Good chair. Chair, very nice. No, you want gel your nail? Oh yeah, I want gel. Do you guys do designs too? What kind of like, I want a little eight ball on my. After we uh, after we do and then uh, we put A for you, huh? Yeah. <laughs> okay, number A. Hello, are you learning Lam? Actually, can I get petty too? Yeah. Can you draw a number eight? Draw a number eight. Okay, draw Okay, draw number eight. You you sit down first. Let me uh, set up uh, first. Okay. Okay. How are you? I'm good, how are you? I'm good, thank you. black, Yeah, black. black <gasps> oh, so cold. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Philippines or Thai? Huh? Are you Philippines or Thai? No, I'm Mexican. Oh, okay. Yeah. He's <laughs> Oh, he's Filipino. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Look like Thai. No, cut, No cut, just file. And no cut cuticle. No cut on toenails and no no cut cuticle either. Just file. My nails painted? No, I'm not good. Don't you usually get like a clear coat? No. Oh. What's your favorite color on a man? <laughs> Blue. Black. <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna wear colors, but I like blue and black. Yeah. Do you think he can pull it off? No. <laughs> I'm gonna just keep the uh, clear regular. Right. Okay. 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 Ok
the farmer. Like one set of blue moon. I normally don't like getting my nose done. Why? Okay. Okay, you guys, so this is the bathroom. It looks pretty freaking gross. These kinds of scents are really bad for you to breathe in, but then again, it's a freaking nail shop. Everything that you inhale here will give you cancer. It looks kind of dirty. A few of the lights are missing. None of the bulbs are the same. Uh, that doesn't quite look right either. That looks really gross. All the tiles all messed up and broken. Hmm. This did only cost $36, including the designs. I'm really worried. The first thing that I did when I sat down was I, I, I told her, don't touch my cuticles because that girl that left that review about getting a disease said that their cuticle cutters were not clean and I insisted don't cut my cuticles and she said oh, honey no cuticle too long and I was like no don't she's like I can't paint nail without it why are you talking like that because I don't know because I'm trying to mimic her and it's just I know, but why are you talking like what do you what like what? I am worried that I contracted something. Why, why are you talking like honey? That's what she said. No. But she, you you know, want to get all sensitive again? No. But you you want to make this about you? You know what okay. she said though. Okay, let's make this about Chino. I'm saying, you know she said honey. Why you have to say it like that? Did you get it all out? Okay, this is he did. No, it's not. Anyways, it's a bit I'm deeply concerned. All jokes aside, I, I am really worried about having gotten something. You won't know until you see it come out on your skin or you have some kind of like sickness or problem. I even told Chino, I was like, Chino, don't let them touch your cuticles. Traps, they did it. They did it! They did it, I just let it happen. I paid for it. By the way, it was really cheap. I paid $36 for a Manny Petty and a design. But I don't know if that makes up for the diseases that we might get. You look cross-eyed. We just got Manicure. HIV. <laughs> Manicures and pedicures. <laughs> Made from the womb of just. Okay. <laughs> we just went and got a mother mm, pedicure with a mother. Look. You are so unstressed and I'm over here ripping my hair out and I'm telling him we gotta go get tested. All right, you guys, so I don't know. I think that we have to follow up this really, really bad nail salon review Bro, with um, a blood test. We're good. You're good. I don't feel like I'm good. I have really, really bad luck. I don't think she cut me. She didn't cut me. So One good. of mine is open. She did cut me. Actually, wow. You just reminded me that. That she did she did cut me. It's okay. No, it's not. She cut me on my cuticle. And I told her, I said, don't touch.
touch my cuticles. She said, Hun she, she said, you need she to. And I almost did it again. I can't help racist. it. You're racist. You'll be fine, okay? Um, anyways, guys, Boots has got to go off to a little dance class. So, we're going to end off this video. Um, out of five stars, what do you give it? A three and a half. Three and a half. I'd give it a, yeah. i give it three and a half, four, maybe. Nah, three and a half is cool. Because I've, 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 I've honestly been to a better nail salon before. And, I've, uh, we've been to nail salons that offer you a free drink. To yeah. get swifty. You get turnt while they do it. That's the best. Yeah. This was, uh, this is interesting. I'll give it three and a half. I agree with you. Three and a half. Three and a half. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't the worst, but it wasn't the best. So it's if, like right in the middle. If I get a blood test and I come back with something, I am going, well, you what am I going to do? What am I going to do? <laughs> what am I going to do? So, um, I guess my rating for this um, nail salon is temporary. I mean, it'll drop down to a one if you're infected. <laughs> but you'll be fine. <laughs> you'll be okay. I'll definitely keep you guys posted on it. Um, let me know if you like this video. Like it, subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you guys very soon. Pray for me. Adios, amigos. Bye. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. Pero... Pero what? Me das un vaso de agua, por favor. Me das un vaso de agua. ¿Y qué más quieres? Estás muy bonita. No necesita maquillaje. Yes. <laughs>